Hello everyone, and welcome back to Let's Play Kingdom Hearts. Um, jeez, it's been such a long time. I think the last episode was uploaded about 20 days ago, which means I recorded it probably close to a month ago. Today is December 1st, and it is actually a very important day because yesterday was the day I turned in my application for transfer. What the hell were we doing when we left? Uh, I think we, I think, yeah, we just defeated the Trick Master, which is the boss of this world. Uh, yeah, I probably should have watched the last video to kind of remember what I did, but whatever. I'm doing this kind of blind because I didn't know exactly what I did. Oh yeah, there's a lot of stuff that we missed in this world. Like a lot of quirky stuff you could do with the environment, so I might just, uh, you know, do that during this episode and kind of just explain what's been taking so long with making the next episode. So after uploading the last episode, I had made a decision that um, that I was going to watch a Medilli. God, I can't even speak anymore. That I was going to just stop recording for about a week. You know, I was like, you know, I'm gonna take a break for a week because I needed to catch up on you know stuff with work, stuff with school, and things like that. Uh, but eventually, that week went on to a little bit longer because I. Uh, I kind of wasted my time, to be perfectly honest. Go, make me big. So what we're doing is just we're just going around this world and just trying to take care of a few things. All right, so let's take that, eat that. But yeah, I've been busy with, uh, you know, work, catching up on making my portfolio for SI. I don't know how much of any of this I've talked about before, but. I was also doing my applications, and, and I was done my applications pretty uh, soon after the first time that. Or, okay, see, when you came here, this bucket came up. And I think I already mentioned that this is the bizarre room, we're just on a different end of it. Rather than the floor, which is directly in front of us, we're on one of the walls. Uh, I think there's something we can do here. Yeah, we can. Yeah, we can hit this. I'll drop water into that thing and make it pop up. I don't know what the point of any of this is. It's just kind of funny and interesting, and it reminds me a lot of the actual movie, Alice in Wonderland. <clears throat> what else? I think if you go in here, you go into another part of the bizarre room. Drop into the chimney, and now you're on the opposite wall, I believe. Let's find out. Man, these controls are so awkward. But yeah, as I was doing that, so you can see there's some more lamps here that you can light. And I thought you had to light all four of these lamps, because every other time that I've played this game, I've lit these lamps first. So I didn't know that you just needed to do those two in the other... Uh... Which am I doing? The other... You know, the upside-down room. Oh, we get a defense up. So, this is a kind of a... Uh... God, Facebook messaging. Maybe I should close that. Nah, deal with it. Um, but this is a kind of a item. There's a defense up, power up, and an AP up. And these do permanent upgrades to one of your characters. I'm going to use it on myself since after that run-in with Riku, like nine times or however many it was, I don't really want to... Yeah, whatever. Uh... There's a way to make that book come out, I can't remember. Oh yeah, the teddy bear, here. Get to this teddy bear. Should be able to do something with it. Can't remember what, though. Or maybe I can just go up to the book. No. No, I can't remember. Gosh. But there's something in here, I know that. You can examine this and you fall into it, water-like. Oh, there's another Trinity mark, Trinity mark around here. White one. Can't really activate it yet. Give me an elixir. Give me a potion. Go back into the bizarre room. Uh. No, I'm missing something. One of these lion heads, you can do something with this. And I know you can do something with the teddy bear. Oh. Just have to hit him. And that makes the book stand up. Oh, and then he falls down there. 
I think, and you can do something with the book. No. Yeah, see, it's like completely random. I don't know what the purpose of any of it is. There's a way to make this clock come out, I thought. Yeah, I don't remember a lot of this. I should have practiced. But, uh, anyways. Let's see if I can get that this time. Nope. Whatever, let's just get out of here. Ooh, back to the tea party. No, I don't want to go here. I don't want to go here. Oh. Or here. And you might notice that we're not running into any more Heartless, and that's because we've already taken care of all the Heartless in this world. So, there's nothing more to be done here, really. Might as well just move on to the next one. So yeah, let's get out of here. Uh... Maybe I can get to that chest. No, there's no way. It's impossible. Not from here. So yeah, we'll come back here later, maybe, when I realize what I've missed. Wow, six minutes already when we haven't done Jack in this level. It's fantastic. I haven't even done explaining it. But yeah, the application I was done with within the first week, and I was just, you know, revising the essays and stuff like that. And, it, like, it's it was so silly because... I was just changing a few wordings on the thing, like, the, the gist of my essay was the same, so there's really no uh, point to changing anything. I should have just sent it in, but I sent it in yesterday at 6 p.m., and it was, yesterday was the due date. Yesterday was the last day to go. Now, you can see here on the world map that the battle level to this world that's next to me is Battlestar level 3, and this is level 2, so you'd think that this is the next one you should go to. But not exactly. I'm going to go to this one first, and for a good reason. You'll see. We'll find out later. Right off the drive, this stupid piece of crap. Ahem. <clears throat> Anyways. So yeah, the application and all that stuff. Um, and also, like, as I was applying, like, I originally just applied to, you know, just a couple universities, and I slowly started to broaden my uh, possibilities, applied to a few more. There were still UCs, so I didn't have to do more applications, so all I had to do was say, oh, send the application to these schools too. And you think that, oh, you might as well send it to every school, but, you know, of course you have to pay for these applications, so I don't want to really pay for some place that I know I'm not going to go. But I ended up applying to six of the uh, eight or nine, six of the nine that they had. So, yeah, I applied to LA, Berkeley, Irvine, Riverside, Santa Barbara because it actually surprised me how high up on the uh, engineering list Santa Barbara was and you know I hear, hear a lot of a lot about them and I was doing research. I'm actually thinking of applying to USC too. Originally I decided not to just because I was too busy doing the UC applications and stuff with school and stuff like that. But now I realize that it's, the applications due in February for transfers, so I might apply there and of course I'm applying to U to Caltech. I still gotta study for that exam there. I mean, I am studying, but not like hardcore. I'm gonna wait till the semester's over. And there goes my winter break, too, because I have a really long winter break going to junior college. You know, I have five weeks or something. So it's gonna give me plenty of time to study, but I was originally planning to spend the weekend and going to the East Coast to visit some family. But, uh, I guess not this, not this year. I'll probably go sometime afterwards, though. Not to mention, I'd like to go out to San Francisco to visit my brother again. He left. I don't know if he had left before I posted the last video, but he had moved out of the house, and now he lives up in North California by himself. All right. Hey, Donald. Maybe King Mickey's down there. I can't skip these dialogues. In a backwater place like that? No way! <coughs> Jeez. Let's move on. Hold on! Rico and Kyrie might be down there! Let's just check it out! Forget it! We're on an important mission! Just land! No! Oh great, I took you a long time to say no, Donald. Come on! Ah, fairy! We're landing! Uh-oh. Sora, you don't have a license! No! Don't touch that! No! And we're crash landing. It's funny how, like, whenever an aircraft or spacecraft crashes, most of the people still live. 
I mean, well, I guess in reality most people survive plane crashes, but this is a pretty bad one. I mean, look how far up he fell from. He fell through like three layers of wood, and he's just got a headache? Oh, my head. He didn't even get a concussion. Donald? Goofy? Uh-oh. <gasps> it's a cheetah. I want time to figure that out. No, it's not a cheetah. Is it? Is that a cheetah or is that just... It could be a leopard. Whoa, whoa, get back. Alright. So we're just thrown right into a fight with a cheetah. It's kind of different from the people we're used to fighting. And he doesn't have a big black personality or not big black look to him. It's just a cheetah. Beating the crap out of a cheetah. Alright, let's go! 15 points, not too bad. Did quite well. Look at this. So I was like, yeah, boy. Oh, he gets back up. Please from someone with a wooden stick, and I got a giant key. It's way so more bold. fearsome. Danger. Uh, thank you. Thank you. Uh, uh, what is this place? This place. This place. Okay. Where did the others go? Look, I got separated from my friends. Have you seen them? Hmm. <laughs> Friends. Friends. Right, my friends. There's two of them. The loud one is Donna. Huh? Huh? You know what? Never mind. I'm looking for my friends, Riku and Kairi. Look for Riku. Friends. Right. Kairi. Friends. Uh, Kyrie. Right. Um. Uh, oh, friend, here. Really? <laughs> huh? <laughs> Friends, here. Not sure I understand, but show me. Take me to Riku and Kyrie. Tarzan. Tarzan, go. And I'm Sora. Tarzan go, Sora go go. Go go Power Rangers. I'm oh, sorry about that. Alright, and that brings us to our next world. This is the deep jungle. Yeah. I actually kind of like this world. It's very, uh. atmospheric. One of my more favorite worlds. George, where are we? I sure hope Sora's okay. Ah! Who needs them? Big good friend, you can't look out them. Huh? Ah! Oh? Yep, he's got a gun, and he refuses to take his medicine. Anyways. But yes, what else was I doing? So now Tarzan's in our party instead of Donald and Goofy. So this uh, brings in the mechanic of the game where you can switch out party members. You can only hold three at a time, but some some worlds allow you to have one extra character in your party. He's not get like you can only have three active members, but sometimes you can have uh, an additional member to choose from. Uh, honestly, I don't like the like the extra characters except for Tarzan. Tarzan is the only good one to have. All the other ones, as you'll see, they're they're kind of useless because they use up all their magic, like using like, stupid abilities, 
Like, you know, Goofy has his charge ability, like, the other characters use up those abilities immediately, unless you program them, and customize them not to. And in that, and anyways, like, they're just retarded. Because you can't, like, give them better weapons or anything like that. You couldn't give them these accessories, but why would you if you can't take them to other worlds with you? Anyways, max HP and strength. So we're not going to really be dealing with fire anymore. Let's put this on. Oh yeah, by the way, I don't know if like you're supposed to be able to come up here at the, at the beginning of this level without the high jump ability, because you can see how I got up here. Like If I just try and jump, it's not going to work. You have to swing the Keyblade at the right moment and you can make it up there. And there's another place in this world where you can do the same thing. So I don't know if the programmers intended for that or whatever, but... Yeah, let's go for it. God, we're at 16 minutes already? Jeez, all right, save point. I don't really want to end the video here. I think I want to get to the next cutscene first. So the next thing we got to do is, well, maybe I can go in from here. Ooh, let's open this. You know what, I'm just going to actually play this game the way I normally play it. I'm going to jump in this stump. So this takes you into a little bit of a mini game. Right now it's kind of incomplete, it's just a little like fast way to get to where you need to go. But later in the game, you can like redo this little slide area and there's fruits. There's ten fruits scattered on the slide and you have to grab all of them. And if you do, you're taken onto like a secondary part. These branches can hurt you by the way, if you hit them. Like you can get them out of your way by slashing them. You can see there's a path there to the left. If you get all the ten fruits and go down that path, then you can end up somewhere else and you can get some really good items. I really hope that this microphone is working, or like, I had uh, customized, like done some tweaking in the settings of my microphone and my recording software, so that you could hear my voice a little bit better, because before I was just being very, like the voice was really quiet, and I'd have to use Sony Audition, uh, sorry, Adobe Audition to uh, amplify it and remove white noise and stuff like that. And who's this? Uh, hi there. I'm... Oh, you speak English. So then, obviously you're not related to Tarzan. Are you here to study the gorillas? Highly doubtful. Zoro! Goofy! Donald! <laughs> There's the Goofy with a huge-ass mouth. Not much use for hunting gorillas. Mr. Clayton, we're studying them, not hunting them. This is research. Well, the more the merrier. Do make yourselves at home. Well, anyway... I'm staying! Huh? Sora, look what we found. Look at this. <laughs> Goofy, how I miss to hear your voice. It's a gummy block, the same stuff used to build our ship. So that means the king could be here, so we gotta work together to look for him. For now. Fine, I'll let you tag along. For now. And we get the gummy thing. Whatever, I don't care. I'm gonna keep Tarzan. I'm gonna take Donald out because he's useless right now. And I'm gonna keep Tarzan in for one reason. If you look at here, at his abilities, he has this thing called Healing Herb, where he uses his magic, and he basically heals you. He's got heal magic, and he also has wind armor, which is also really useful. He's got these other abilities too, but the win uh, the, the healing one is what it's all about. So, what I'm going to do is I'm going to customize Tarzan to use his regular attacks constantly, special attacks occasionally, defensive moves frequently, and HP items only an emergency. That'll make him the most useful to us. So right now we are... what should we call it? Let's talk to Jane. Apparently Tarzan was raised in the jungle by the gorillas. Communicating with him still isn't easy, but he's learning. So who's speaking gorilla back there? That's right, you're looking for your friends? He said Riku and Kairi are here, and one word I couldn't understand. Why don't we try this? We'll show Tarzan some slides and see if any of them match that word. Oh, what happened to the slides? So now we gotta find the slides. 
which will do that, and I think that'll be enough to conclude this video. Haven't really accomplished very much, but then again, we never really do. So the slides look like this, this little spinning thing. Slide number three. Uh, this You can use this stove to make some stuff, but we gotta find some recipe cards. They're hidden in this sector. Come on, break the box. I don't think there's anything in here, though. Yeah, nothing. So, one of the recipe cards is in this globe, which allows you to make an ether. Slide number six there. Another slide over here. Jeez, uh, the camera control is just so weird for me. Because, in addition to that, like, I wasn't doing any recording, but that doesn't mean I wasn't playing games. I, uh... I was also playing uh, Final Fantasy X and Final Fantasy XII, kind of side by side. Um, did we get all the slides? I think we're still missing one. What have you got to say, man? Clayton's a name. I'm a hunter, not a researcher. Okay, that's nice to know, but you're here drinking three cups of tea. Uh, there's another recipe card in the clock. There should be three more. One here on the clothesline. Uh, should be another one in this thing, I think. No, no, in this thing. And the last one is at the bottom of this pole here. Alright. Did we get all the slides? I think we did. Let's check it. Stock. One, two, th no, we're missing number two. Where was slide number two? I'm pretty sure it's around here somewhere. I know it's in the sector, but... But, uh... We already went across the top of the... Tent. Did we already look here? Alright, there we go. And... See, the camp... Like, I keep pressing R2 thinking I'll look left. But it's really L2. Let's check out these slides. Did you find the slides? They must be lying around. Oh, wait. let's examine this. Tarzan, is this your. <laughs> What's wrong, Sora? Um, nothing. The place. It looks so familiar. Yep. I'm gonna make this. I'm gonna make reference to this later. But how? I've never been off my island. Uh. A man giving flowers to someone. Uh, it's a baby and an old woman who drops her cane to pick up a baby. That's a gorilla. And that's the Santa Maria. And this is faceless people sword fighting. Well, Tarzan? Where are my friends, Riku and Kairi? Hey, I thought... That leaves just one place. Young man, we've been in this jungle for some time now. But we have yet to encounter these friends of yours. I'd wager they're with the gorillas, but Tarzan refuses to take us to them. Really, Mr. Clayton? Tarzan wouldn't hide. Then take us there. Take us to the gorillas. Gorillas. Why is Sora's cheek so pink? Tarzan, are you sure? Tarzan, go see Kerchak. Kerchak? He must be the leader. Perfect. I'll go along as an escort. After all, the jungle is a dangerous place. Dun dun dun! And that seems to be a good place for us to stop here. So, um, tune in next time and we will find Kerchak, I guess. You know what, I'm gonna save to a new file so that I don't screw up everything. There we go. Alright then, see you guys later.